Well, Chris, the uh, superintendent, police, and principals have just announced a plan to keep thousands of students safe. I don't think we realize the magnitude of what this, how this will affect our kids. Thanks to News Channel 5, the superintendent of Euclid Schools, Keith Bell, has seen enough. And he doesn't want to see any more of this. Students using the street because sidewalks are torn up for gas line construction on busy East 222nd. After an emergency meeting with principals and police today, Bell told me two Euclid police officers will work as crossing guards, helping students get to and from school starting Tuesday morning. We would be able to deploy. Um, crossing guards. Students at Euclid High School and Pinnacle Charter School will hear about the new plan during announcements Monday afternoon. Bell told me parents of 1,800 Euclid High School students will also get robocalls this weekend, alerting them to talk to their kids about crossing carefully during this construction. And Bell sent this letter to the school board today, advising them of the new plan, which also mentions police will warn students that they could get citations for jail. Walking. As this gas line is installed, more sidewalks are torn up, so this construction zone keeps shifting, and now so will the crossing guards. We're going to have to look at how we redefine our deployment practices as the construction site moves. The bottom line is we want to try to do everything we can to make sure the kids are safe. Now, the superintendent said there is one flag person out here for this big construction project, but that person has to focus on all of the traffic chaos that happens when two schools let out between 2.30 and 4 o'clock here on East 222. Live in Euclid, Paul Kiska, News Channel 5. All right.